In this video, we explain procedures to fill the tanks, transfer fluid, and the solution agitation feature of the exact rate tractor tanks and fluid transfer system. This system is available on John Deere 8RX tractors. Two integrated tanks allow the tractor to carry up to 3,785 liters, 1,000 gallons of solution. Solution can then be offboarded to fill implement commodity tanks. Refer to your operator's manual for component locations and additional information. Important: Avoid transporting the tractor with fluid in the tanks. Never exceed total tractor transport weight of 24,040 kilograms or 53,000 pounds. Transport speeds are limited depending on weight and implement being towed. To avoid track damage, refer to tractor and implement operator's manuals. Connect hydraulic hoses to the top SCV. Attach hydraulic hoses so that the pump runs when the SCV control lever is placed into the retract position. Set flow rate of this assigned SCV to a maximum flow of 6.4. On the rear of the left hand tank, you find the fluid transfer system. It consists of an onboard transfer fluid pump and valves to perform fluid transfer, agitation, and tank rinse. Refer to chart in the operator manual explaining position of valves while performing various functions. Begin by verifying that the front fill valve, if equipped, and rear implement valves are closed. Place the tractor tank fill valve in the transfer position. On the underside of the tractor, locate both left and right tractor tank valves. These valves must be in the open position. Once the valves are open, the solution from both tractor tanks flow into the inlet of the hydraulically driven onboard transfer pump. With the tank fill valve in the transfer position, solution is blocked from flowing into the fill circuits. After connecting an implement, couple the fluid transfer hose. Open both implement coupler valves. Open the implement tank valve. The implement tank check valve prevents solution from flowing to the tractor. Now let us discuss how to fill both tractor tanks and implement tank from the rear of our implement. Begin by moving tractor tank fill valve into the receive position. Couple tender tank to the rear implement fill valve. Open both implement fill valve and tender tank valve. Transfer solution to tanks using the tender tank pump. Solution flows through the open tank valve to both tractor and implement tanks. If the implement tank is higher than the tractor tanks, solution will first flow to the tractor tanks. This flow occurs until the fluid level reaches the bottom of the implement tank. Monitor fluid level using sight gauges as tanks fill. When tractor tank volume reaches 80%, you are notified by the hazard lights flashing and the horn honking periodically for 10 seconds. Important: While tanks can be filled simultaneously, the lowest tank in the system should be closed once full to prevent overflow. If tractor tanks fill first, move the tractor tank fill valve into the transfer position once full. Continue to allow implement tanks to fill. Once implement tanks are full, close both implement fill valve and tender tank valves before disconnecting the tender tank from the implement. Now let us discuss how to fill both tractor and implement tanks using the optional front fill. Begin by placing the tractor tank fill valve into the receive position.
Connect the tender tank to the front fill valve. Open both tender and front fill valves. Transfer solution using the pump on the tender tank. Monitor the solution level as tanks are filled. Important, while tanks can be filled simultaneously, the lowest tank in the system should be closed once full to prevent overflow. If tractor tanks fill first, move the tractor tank fill valve into the transfer position once full. Continue filling implement tanks as discussed earlier. Once full, close front fill and tender tank valves before disconnecting. As needed, solution can be transferred from the tractor tanks to the implement tank on the move. To transfer solution, place top or associated SCV control lever into the retract position to drive the onboard transfer pump. Solution flows past closed valves and check valves into the implement tank. Tractor tank level can be monitored on the Generation 4 display by navigating to Exact Rate Tractor Tank. This tractor tank module can also be added to your tractor run page. When the implement tank is full or the tractor tanks are empty, Move the associated SCV control lever into the float position. This allows fluid to slowly stop flowing. After 10 seconds, the SCV control lever can then be returned to the neutral position. If needed, the exact rate fluid transfer system can also be used to agitate the solution in tractor tanks. Important, to avoid system damage, Never use the tank agitation feature when the tank solution level is less than 38 liters, 10 gallons, or with the implement coupler open. To agitate solution, begin by closing the implement coupler valves. Open the agitation valve with the fill valve in the transfer position. Start the onboard transfer pump by placing associated SCV control lever into the retract position. Solution is now circulated through the agitation nozzles located in each tank. Complete agitation by placing the associated SCV control lever into the float position for 10 seconds before returning to neutral. 